Welcome back to Zalanka. It's uh, the beginning of October. And you know what? There's a vegetable harvester we haven't used yet. It's the one with, that does the two rows. So we're going to do a contract for some red beets, as much as I hate to do it. And we're going to use it. it. does not have a capacity, so there's no hopper on it. Uh, but it does two rows, <laughs> so maybe it'll go faster. Wouldn't hold my breath. Well, let's get it out to the field. Got a newer Zetor crystal. I think I have my uh, field info on from when I was recording Bali Spring. I'll turn that off. I wonder if I can get there quicker going this way. We'll try. It's it's up on top of the hill over there. I can get to it by going over that dirt road. There's like a cut through over here too. You can cut off some of this trip. So maybe I'll try that. I like this map. Looking good in October. I don't know. There should be a, a track off to my left. Is that it? Yep. Now, which one? I'm going to take this one. Take the path less traveled. Gonna regret this, aren't I? Probably. It's going the way I want to go. Interesting. Uh, maybe I should do that. I want to go across a creek up here. I think I might go straight to it. Does. Perfect. Yeah, this is this is interesting. I'm looking forward to seeing how this one works. Well, I imagine we're going to have to get the uh, worker to drive this. Okay, here we go. Oh, shoot, it's a funny shaped field. Let's go to the far end. Now let's just start right here. So swing it out. And unfold it. Nope. Pipe out. Uh, that? Nope, that. Nope, that. There we go. Wonder what all those other buttons I was pushing do. Can't be good. Get some height on that. Just to be safe. Let's check out our uh, 
button options here. All right. Nothing in L1, R1. And adjust it left and right. That's good. And then... it right there we'll go grab the what was it a John Deere with the trailer it's gonna be a little bit of a walk hmm. where's this one go We'll see you back here in a few minutes. All right, I'm on my way back here. It's like a maze of fields. I remember walking by this cornfield on the way out. So if there's a track on the far side of it. Yeah, there is. I think I can get back to that bridge that I crossed. Yep, there it is. I think. Yeah. Right over here. Maze over here. There we go. All right. It'd be nice if we had bigger size. I don't know what kind of capacity we're going to end up having on this. I guess we don't need to drop it quite so far, do we? That's not going to be fun. All right. Let's see. There we go. All right, let's lower. Like that, because we don't need it to be up very high. Okay, so if I, what? Should I tab? Which way do I tab? To the right. Yep. Okay. Ready? Go. Working. She had it to wagon. <laughs> this is gonna be, make it even more fun. Which way is he gonna go? What's he doing? Uh oh. those poles are going to be a problem? Probably.
Driving wagons is always fun. <laughs> Semi cruise control on the uh, oops. All right, let me get my cruise control. What eight do you think? Sure. Nope. Faster. This was pretty quick. We go like 11 or 12. 11, I think. There we go. Oh. This is, uh, well, interesting. We're on the short side of the field here, so these are kind of shorter runs, but those two rows, and it seems to go fairly quick. Let's just start on the long side, I guess, maybe. Get good camera angles for you, and I end up messing up. <laughs> okay, how about this? Yeah. sure how we're going to pull this one off. We're going to have to back up, aren't we? Oh, maybe I can sneak in from this side. go. Two rows.
Alright, I gotta figure out where the soup factory is now. It's over this way. <laughs> That's a nice cul culvert there. Well modeled. This trailer doesn't hold that much, 14,000. It's about the same as our uh, gloss trailer, I think. Let's try and take the back road somewhat, avoid traffic. So we'll go down this one. We head straight, this must be south, south on this road. We go past our farm, past the machinery dealership, come out by the farm shop, and then it's kind of down that way. So I like the vegetable harvester, but I don't know. I keep getting in the way of it, but I think it's because I'm trying to uh, see what's going on and get a good angle on it. Okay, so what I want to try and do is I want to cut over to the right here. I guess I could go where that car is. think. I don't know if this was a mistake. <laughs> oh. And then take a left here. Yeah, this might have been a mistake. Yeah, this is more in town than I wanted to end up being. Is there another way I could do that? Maybe like over by that. No? That was it. Alright, so here we are at Zoop Zoop Zoop. Where do we deliver at Zoop Zoop Zoop? Right there. Yeah, there we go. Alright, I think I turned it to tip side left.
So it might just be easier to come down to this corner and turn turn right there. that go through? There's an option. That track. Oh, did that track go through? Mm -hmm. I guess I got plenty of times going back and forth to figure out the most efficient route. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you back at the field. It's almost three o'clock in the afternoon already. We're arriving back at the contract field. Some nice details on this map. Anyway, uh, we'll get back out there and keep working on these, uh, what, red beets? This is going to take a while, I think, but I don't know if we'll get this done today or not. It says we're only 16% completed. All right, I'm going to jump between. Well, I'll go over. I'll go over, get it started. Ooh, got a little. All right, I'll start a worker again, then I'll jump over to my tractor. Okay, now I've got to try and keep up. Nope. Oh. Dark comes. I like this one. I don't know how much, well, it should be twice as fast, right? They used to always be my uh, argument in favor of, you know, upgrading equipment, you know, say going from a three meter uh, seed drill to a four meter seed drill. Like, well, you can do it in, uh, you can do in three passes what you used to be able to do in four passes. Well, if you got a two row harvester like this, you're basically doubling how much coverage you have. So that's pretty significant. Let's see if I can keep it going straight here for a little bit. Maybe we can check it out. Um, heading towards it. I keep heading towards the vehicle or, <clears throat> excuse me, or away from it. Let me kick up the speed a little bit there. And of course, what did I do? I cut him off. <sighs> All right, let me get going again. <laughs> Wish they had like a sync to tractor button. That it? And maybe they just need to be better, right? Let's see if I can get out the way here. It's gonna have. Bit of room he's gonna need. To get to where he wants to go. So I accepted another contract kinda 
toward the southern edge of the map for a sunflower harvest. I don't know if I'll just completely do that one off camera or, or how we'll approach that one. But this... I don't think... I don't think we can get this done today. It's just too big. Or just too slow. Maybe I can. I don't know. It's 3 o'clock in the afternoon already, though. I'm not sure when it's going to start getting dark. I'd like to be able to look at this thing operate, but it's just too difficult for me to try to <laughs> get in the right spot and keep the tractor going straight. Give me a minute. I'll get out the way. Give me a minute. I'm trying. We're getting more with each pass as the field's getting uh, bigger as we're moving over to the to the large side. I think what a couple more passes and then we'll have like full length. There we go. This is on the sun sunshiny side. This is. This is going to be our opportunity to see what's going on. If I can keep the tractor going straight and not get going too fast. Whoa! Not get going too fast. What the heck? Uh. Yep. Come on now, get under there. Alright, I just gotta pay attention to what I'm doing, I think. Did I hit him? <laughs> Good lord. as close <clears throat> I guess yeah when I get anywhere we're probably going to have to start time lapsing again
I like this one a lot. This one's pretty fun. Uh, it gets it done faster than the single row one. So I think that's that's a big plus. Uh, I prefer it over the self-propelled one. Yeah, this is this is definitely one I would buy. I I would almost upgrade or buy any harvester that came available in the used market just to save money. Uh, but I would say I think this one might be my favorite one to use. Although the one with the uh, hopper is right up there. So obviously we're losing daylight. Um, we're going to keep going. We've coordinated with the soup factory to continue to receive into the evening. So we'll keep going. I think it'll be one trailer load after this one. I think. I don't know. Kind of hard to say. How many times we go back and forth. But yeah, I like this one a lot. It's good. Really good. It looks good. It works good. Speed here. Oh, I get too close. My biggest problem is I occasionally get too close more than I get too far away, to be honest with you. What are you blocked by? I guess I'm more worried about being too far away, but that rarely happens. <laughs> um, yeah, more often than not, I cut them off. I found a good route to the uh, soup factory as well. You just keep going by down to the farm shop and then there's, I guess it's the last, be the last field. There's a track that goes almost straight across to the drive into the soup factory. So that's pretty convenient. It's easy to recognize because it's a cotton field and the field before it, I think, has lime on it, too, so they kind of stick out to you as you're driving down the road there. So I think, what, we're at 80% on this way back. We should fill it, maybe. Yeah, got into him again. Okay, dude. Oh, no. Ah. Speed up. There you go. All right. I just got a hard time maintaining that distance. I don't know why. Come on. Oh, okay. He can't get going. I can't get going. <laughs> yeah, the hill's getting trickier here. I'm heavy. I think. I don't know. Guys, nah, run away from me.
We'll get just a little bit here and then we'll be full. Wow, I don't know. I like it though. It's nice. We're not going to go very far at all here. Oh, they block him. I tell you. They didn't have this much trouble with the other one, though. That's what's kind of weird. Okay, there we go. All right. I'll leave the lights on so I can find my way back to it. Yeah, I know that these aren't too enjoyable in the dark, so we'll probably go ahead and wrap up the episode as we deliver this. I think uh, I'll go ahead and finish this tonight anyway, and, and I'll, I'll see you again in mid-October. We'll get on that Sunflower Harvest contract that we took, but... Um, I think we've used all the vegetable harvesters now. No, we haven't used the one that's got the four boxes. We haven't done that one yet. I think it's a single row though. If it were a double row, that would probably become my favorite. So we gotta try and use that one sometime. I don't know when. I don't know if there's any more uh, vegetable harvests that'll need to get done. Uh, I'll have to look. We gotta try that one. That would be good. The village looks really nice at night. The lighting with all the little individual lights and the lights in town. Really nice. I like it. A lot of times I don't see the maps at night because I don't like to work at night, but this one, oh, I hope I didn't take that sign up. If I did, it was in the dark and you didn't see it, but yeah, the, the lights of the village look really good on here. Um, at least for for driving around. I don't like to work in the dark though. It's just not that much fun. So I gotta tell you, I uh, appreciate you hanging out with me here at Zilanka if you made it this far. I know your time is valuable to you, and I appreciate you chose to spend a little of it here with me. I do like the premium expansion. It's it's good. I don't know if I'm there. Thought I was gonna miss it. <laughs> we'll hit the beacons. See if we got traffic coming. Clear left, clear right, kind of. If we can get across quickly. Didn't make him have to break too much. Turn that back light on there so we can see what's going on as we unload this. And again. 
if you enjoyed it, hit that like button. And if you don't subscribe yet, why not? It don't cost nothing. I'll see you mid-October. We'll have a little bit more money. Not too much. And, uh, yeah. See you next time.